Hey guys, welcome to another vlog. I am already having a good day. I turned on the radio and Truth Hurts by Lizzo came on. I was jamming and now I went and got a drink that I've actually never gotten before at Starbucks. I'll just let you guys know what it is. It is a grande vanilla cream cold brew in a venti cup with one pump of hate one pump of hazelnut syrup and extra ice so i'm gonna see if i like this i've never tried this before let's see let's do that thing what's anna anna from uh tiktok oh my gosh i almost forgot anna from tiktok she goes another day another starbies and then if she likes it she screams so let's try it Yeah, I'm not going to scream because I feel like that would take a lot of effort. It's pretty early, but um, it's really good. I would definitely get this again. This is definitely my kind of drink. Mm. I hope you guys are having a great day. I'm really hopeful for this week. And of course, you guys see me pretty much eating this once a week. It's like the only like thing I like from there to treat myself, so... Yeah, so I'm about to head to the mall. I need to go to American Eagle because um, I'm really bummed about the jeans that I bought from Abercrombie. Um, so I really need to find some more mom jeans. Hopefully they're gonna have them at um, American Eagle. And then there's one more place I need to go to. Oh, to Torrid. So they had these um, sandals, like slides that I seen in Torrid like online. So I called them to see if they have them in store and they do it. I'm so excited and they have my size. So I'm gonna go try those on. Those are the two things that I'm doing. And um, and then I'm gonna pick up a bottle of wine because I'm like craving like a wine night. I don't know, maybe because it's really close to being bachelor season again. Um, so I'm just thinking like Monday used to be like my wine bachelor and pizza night with my husband. Um, but Steven is in Calgary for two days. Well, not two days, it could be, he could be back tomorrow. It's either he's gone for one night or two night and he won't know till tomorrow. So um, yeah, so it kind of gives me that opportunity to just do charcuterie again because I've got everything I need for charcuterie. I just don't have red wine at home. So I'm going to grab that as well. And then, yeah, that's pretty much going to be my day. I'm just going to hang out and uh, chill on my couch. And then tomorrow I've got like a busy day. But today, that's the plan. I just finished eating dinner. I already got back from the mall quite a while ago. Just having some wine. I didn't end up making charcuterie for dinner because it seemed like a little bit too much work. I was like, I'm not feeling it today getting all that stuff out of my fridge. So I just made these um, cream cheese, turkey and spinach roll up with like our tortilla. And it was really filling in good. And I'm just having some wine and a little bit of chocolate as a treat. I wanted to show you guys what I ended up getting at Torrid. So I went into the store specifically for these sandals. I seen them online. I was like, oh my gosh, they're so cute. And I tried them on and they fit perfectly. I ended up getting them in a size 10 because I always do. I don't own a lot of shoes from Torrid, but I know that all of them I do are all a size 10 because they come so wide and I don't have a very wide foot, just kind of like a regular, it's not like a narrow foot. So I can wear wide shoes, but I have to go down a size. And it was a BOGO sale. So it was buy one, get one half off. And I don't know how I feel about these. They're cute but I don't love them as much. And it was the only other pair in the store that I was kind of like, yeah, I think I'd wear those a lot in the summer. So I don't know if I'm gonna keep these or exchange them for maybe a pair of sneakers. I'm gonna try them on with a cute outfit one of these days to just wear them in the house for you know, a few minutes to see if I like them. But that's the other pair that I got. But guys, I am so obsessed with these slides. They're gonna be perfect for summer. I cannot wait. Um, and then I did end up going to American Eagle, but most of the things that I wanted to order, they had my size in store, but they didn't have the length that I wanted, like with jeans and stuff. So I ended up placing the whole order online. It's gonna get shipped here. And instead of showing you guys on the vlog, I think I might actually film a video um, about American Eagle jeans and just kind of like which ones I like and sizing and things like that. So I think that would be fun. So I'll probably do that. Stay tuned for that. Yeah, I wanted to touch in and show you guys what I ended up getting at Torrid. All right, so I just finished filming and now I actually have to edit the entire video today and get it up on my channel tomorrow because it's got a due date, this one. So um, I actually am going to be doing that. I just had pineapple as a snack to kind of tie me over because um, I had late lunch, but it was like, it was really filling. So gonna have to figure out dinner as well. Steven's gonna be in Calgary till Thursday, which I'm kind of bummed about, but um, it gives me a lot of time to just focus on things that I need to do, like just work stuff. So um, I'm really happy about that 
this week it should be good i've got to get an oil change tomorrow i have to get my hair done this week a bunch of different things which you guys will I'm sure will see in this vlog but um yeah i uh wanted to just give an update on how my day is going so i'm gonna go and edit for a few hours which is gonna be pretty time consuming but it'll be really great when it's all done and uploaded so yeah i'm gonna go and uh, do that i'm 20 minutes early to my oil change um so that's why i'm just sitting in my car waiting i don't want to get there too quickly or too early um i need to put on some chapstick anyway I just got an email from, that's really weird. That was a really weird email. Anyway, um, yeah, so I'm just gonna get my oil changed. And today I have like not really any responsibilities. Like it's just gonna be chill. I put up a new YouTube video this morning. Um, I'm good, everything is chill. I can just kind of do whatever I want after this, which is really good. I'm really excited about it. So um, that's what I'm doing. I'm thinking I'm gonna go get Starbucks because it's, the best obviously and why not it's freaking warm outside it's nice and sunny so i'm um, probably gonna do that afterwards and then yeah harvey kept me up like he got me he didn't keep me up like during the night but like so early this morning i had to get up because he would literally just like whine beside the bed like really really loud until i would give him attention and he didn't want to get up on the bed he wanted me to come down and play with him for hours he did this so i was like you know what i give up i'm gonna just like get up so i got up really early this morning which sucked because i really wanted to sleep in because i didn't really have any more responsibilities so i was like why not but yeah whatever it is what it is he's still a puppy and he's kind of in that phase right now where he's like acting out like crazy if i don't give him attention um so there's lots of training for him to do for sure yeah so um yeah sorry guys my life isn't more interesting right now I feel like why am I why do I even vlog but I feel like I like it because I just I, I'm gonna really really enjoy looking back on these vlogs one day and just like seeing my day-to-day -day life when I was like younger I feel like that's gonna be so cool so that's kind of a big thing on why I do it and also I just feel like it's it's good for you guys to kind of get to know me and like who I am instead of just watching me try on clothes so I think there's some major pros to it for sure all right I just had to find a spot to pull over I just finished getting my oil change and um i seen that mcdonald's has these new like flavored slushies which is fun so i wanted to try them it's all right all right so since today is cinco de mayo i got everything to make mango salsa and marg's lime margaritas um obviously i picked up some other things as well but i did pick up some cosmetic items while i was out and about Yes, I got lemon cake, but I wanted to show you guys. Let me see. Oh, and also, um, I uh, bought every single flavor in the new Hershey's chocolates. They have strawberries and cream, birthday cake, and chocolate cookies and mint. Like, come on. I couldn't even choose, so I was like, I'm buying all three. Um, where are the fun cosmetic items? Okay, I got three things from the cosmetics department. So... Just, these are just makeup wipes. Haven't heard anything about these. I just bought them because it said ultra hydrating and I need new makeup remover wipes. But these are the two products I wanna talk about. So I seen everybody say that this was the KVD dupe, um, like foundation, like, cause it's extremely full coverage. So I wanted to sh like try it for you guys and kind of let you know. I have no idea if I got the right shade. It's really hard to see if this is my shade or not. I don't know. So it's 225. Let's hope it works, but I'll keep you guys posted. And the other thing I seen this, it's the Revlon photo ready rose glow hydrating plus illuminating primer. And if you guys have been watching TikTok and I've been seeing the same videos on TikTok as I have, you know that the glow recipe um, drops that are at Sephora are sold out all the time and everybody's been using them to make their skin look really glowy. And I thought maybe this could be a dupe. Comes with a little like dropper. I have no idea if it will be. I'm just gonna try it because that one's been sold out. I've gone to Sephora three times now and I've tried to get it online and I can't get my hands on it. So either way, this would be a lot cheaper. So I'll keep you guys posted to see if this will work really well. I'm probably gonna put it on my face and mix it with my foundation to try it out. But these are the two new products. Um, that I'm trying out from uh, the drugstore. All right, guys, finished making my mango salsa. So freaking yummy. Let me know if you need the recipe. 
These are the chips I'm eating it with. Just um, different flavors, I believe. Yeah, corn chili and jalapenos. So I'm telling you, this is the best salsa ever. It is so freaking easy to make. It's so good. And I'm just having a lime margarita with it. Salt on the rim. Let's go. So good. All right. I forgot to vlog like all day, but I had a really busy day. Wow. It looks like I've gotten dark circles. I think that's some of my makeup underneath my, <laughs> my eyes. But I went and got my hair done. That's what it looks like from the side, the front, and the other side. Um... She did a really good job. Just pretty much all I did is get a trim and a root touch up. So it was really just like some maintenance on my hair, which uh, I'm so happy I got that done because honestly, I think we're going back into a, some, a little bit more of a lockdown where they're closing hairdressers um, for a few weeks, which is totally a bummer for most, for hairdressers, but I'm really happy that I ended up getting in before that um, because I've got like photo shoots and stuff coming up this um, month. I think I've mentioned that before, so it was really crucial that my hair didn't look like crap. But yeah, so I did that. Um, I'm trying to think about how my day went. So I that was in the morning, and then I came home, and I did a bunch of work for a company that I'm working with called Fig. Um, it's a, like a company that's kind of like... Um, it's a social media platform where they just have clo like short little videos reviewing products, and they pay me to put reviews of clothing on their website. Um, just like I do on YouTube. So I've been working with them for a bit now. And yeah, so I did a bunch of work for them as well today. And then um, Steven got home today from Calgary, which I'm so happy to have him back at home. He was gone for three nights. Um, so he got home today and then we just had sandwiches, super basic like dinner because we both obviously were tired. Um, he went to bed. So um, yeah, I guess it's pretty late now. I almost like, I kind of like fell asleep for like a second or like snoozed off. So my makeup is like so smudged, but I realized that I needed to vlog and I still have a few things I need to do before I go to bed. So I figured I would get up so I didn't just like fall asleep. And obviously my makeup is all on. I'm gonna go take all that off. Hey guys, don't mind my hair. It looks like absolute shit today. It's like so bad. Um, And I don't want to heat style it because I'm not doing anything that's leaving the house today or anything. I don't have to film, I'm caught up. But um, I bought these three different chocolate bars at the grocery store last time, birthday cake, strawberries and cream and co cookies and mint. I'm gonna try them out and let you guys know how I feel about them. And Steven just got home from work. It is four in the afternoon. Let's try this. Okay, first up, oh my gosh, that looks cool. They're like in triangles with ice cream on them. Cookies and mint. Yeah, they're all supposed to be like ice cream flavors, I guess. Um, I definitely had higher hopes for that. It's kind of meh. Okay. Let's try the birthday cake one. It's like really like, the mint is really overpowering, like, and not really in a good way. Let's try this one. Birthday cake. Mmm. That one's good. Yeah. I'm gonna try the strawberries and cream one. I know I'm opening three <laughs> chocolate bars. It's fine, I'll just put them in a Ziploc bag and put them in our snack crate thingy we have. Um, because I love variety as opposed to sticking to one thing. Okay, this is so hard to open. Gosh, okay. Last one, strawberries and cream. My favorite. We're gonna have a lazy day in the house. I'm probably gonna drink some wine. Still got like just over half a bottle of wine left. And Steve and I are trying to figure out what we want for dinner. And we really don't know what we're gonna have. I'm kind of craving Mexican food. Like I want like authentic Mexican food, like homemade pulled pork kind of tacos or something like that. Like that's what I would love. The way my mom makes them with like cilantro and onions. I miss that. <laughs> All right, so we ended up getting a bunch of takeout for dinner. Um, instead of cooking at home, we got so much takeout. We actually made a decent dent in it too. 
we're both so full and now we're finishing watching the remaining episodes of the circle to see who wins the hundred thousand let's see we got a fresh haircut today ayo Steve and i are just on our way to um go thrifting actually i need something that i can refurnish like a piece of furniture for my film room so we're gonna be looking for that and just in general honestly we, i can't remember the last time i set foot in a thrift store and i see everybody constantly on tiktok and i'm like you know what it's rainy outside like extremely rainy we can't do anything like outdoors we can't even take harvey out because it would be a train wreck in this weather so we're gonna do that and we're getting bubble tea those are the plans we have for today um do anything else going on you said you want to go to the grocery store right? that we that we need to go yeah probably gonna stop by the grocery store to get a few things um yeah because honestly guys it is straight up pouring out not pouring it's pouring no. it's just like really the rain the last two days yeah it's very like cloudy i feel like foggy too Which one I want. Probably those. No. Hey guys, I've got Harvey here. We're just waiting for Steven to be finished playing his last uh, video game. And don't mind my hair, it looks absolutely insane. I just washed it and I'm just air drying it. Um, so we're going to go to the grocery store because he didn't end going yesterday. And um, taking Harvey for a walk. Happy Mother's Day to all of you guys out there. The only thing I'm celebrating is being a dog mom with this little peanut here. He's being such a sweet little boy today. You're so sweet, Harvey. You're such a sweetie. I love him so much. Oh. Um, yeah, so we're gonna go do that and then pretty much just hang out. Groceries and chilling with Harvey Pooh. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one.